Hey guys, welcome. This is the Nerdiest RN. Uh, getting ready to show you how to light up your Detolfs from Ikea. Uh, these Detolfs are used for uh, action figures, premium format figures, uh, display of anything you want to do. For me, I do Hot Toys figures, McFarlane figures, NECA, things like that. Anyways, let's get to the point of the video. So these Detolfs, they are from Ikea. They are $69. Uh, they do not come with lighting. You have to provide your, get your own lighting and then you gotta make sure it doesn't look like crap because there's a lot of videos with a lot of wires everywhere. Anyways, gonna show you a quick video on how to do it and make it the, less, the least possible wires as possible. Anyways, here you go. So the lighting in here, they are LED strips. They are from Home Depot, as you can see. There's four of them. One, two, three, and four, which is perfect for the Detoff. Uh, it's uh, just the right amount. So anyways, let's get in here and see how this is done. So they have adhesive on the top of them, okay? You're just gonna strap them to the top. As you can see, there's black electrical tape on this one. And the reason is because it's heavy and it keeps it up there. It's supposed to, anyways, and you might need to put readjust that. Um, anyways, so that keeps it up there and it also hides it kinda well because it's white on a black top. So anyways, you see the wires going down, you do the zip ties just to make the make the wire snug against the metal rod that comes with the Detolf. So it's part of the Detolf, guys. And then as you can see, uh, there's also these rubber stopper type things, which uh, they hold up the glass case. And so, but the great thing about them is you can line them up and thread the wire through them so it, it hides it better. Once again, you got zip ties here which tighten the LED up. Sorry if it's too bright, guys. Um, and it's, it's really a zigzag process just to hide it, hide the wire, but it's totally worth it. You don't want a whole bunch of wires hanging around everywhere. And then once again, you just line it up, you tighten up the zip tie where you want it, thread it through the rubber stoppers, whatever you want to call them. And you go to the corner here and then you got zip ties again, tighten it up. Just kind of line it up with that rod. Then you got another zip tie there. Thread it through. We're gonna come around here. You're gonna thread it, thread it through the rubber thing there. Another one. And then, ch -ch -ch. and you got another zip tie. Zip ties are good for tightening them on the corners to make sure they stay in place. Once again, this is the last one here. So you come here to the corner, right? Oh, excuse me, this isn't the last one, almost. So you zip tie it, zip tie it all the way straight down. And then this is the little snafu kind of you get to come with. You got the Y connector sight here. I know, I'm sounding like a, nur a nurse now. Anyways, uh, so you got one end going up, which is plugging in the light. Then you got the other end, which you're gonna double it up here, but zip tie it to make it straight and tight still. Zip tie it again down here. Then you got one, one part of that Y sight is coming, hooking to the last LED here, okay? On this LED, there is no finish here. This, there is no extra wire. This is it, this is the end of it. So right here, you, you have that Y sight coming down straight, and this is your power cord. This is your little switch you got for the on and off. Okay, and then for that, you just go underneath the Detolf, and then come around here on the other side where it's all underneath. You don't have to worry about it. Straight to the plug-in, look, no messy wires, no nonsense. I uh, hope this video was good. Uh, stay tuned for my other videos. I'm gonna start doing some reviews on Hot Toys, Sideshow stuff, 
and uh, maybe some NECA and McFarlane possibly, but mostly Hot Toys, Sideshow. All right, guys, thanks for watching.